fire signs okay we have the knight of swords here some truth needs to be delivered the seven of swords someone is sneaking and lying being deceptive the four of pentacles yet still trying to hold on to you crazy six of pentacles and the seven of pentacles this person knows that you're waiting on them to give you what it is that you give to them okay yet and still they continue to bend the truth argue with you go back and forth cause chaos deal with outside parties and that is confirmed by the underlying energy of the three of cups this person is only committed to you with the knight of cups half of the time not all of the time because they're also involved with someone else here okay let's go around one more time see what's going on this person is like trying to hold on to you um because they know that you're a good person to be with but they're not being good to you by any means okay let us see knight of swords here for our fire signs knight of swords okay we have the fool card so you're seeking truth because you want to have a brand new beginning i feel like this is not the first time this person has lied to you or deceived you in some way um perhaps you're trying to rebuild trust with this person all right um you're up at night thinking about the things that they've done to you and the reason you're up at night thinking about it is not because you're holding grudges or anything like that this is spirit's way of trying to communicate with you and let you know that there's still things going on. There's still things you don't know about, okay, that are happening. Yeah, we have the Four of Pentacles and the Two of Cups. They're trying to hold on to you because they know that you're a soulmate of theirs, okay? But this person has commitment issues. They have difficulty committing themselves to just one person, all right? The Six of Pentacles and the Seven of Pentacles here, they're well aware of the fact that you're waiting on them to commit, like I said, to give you what it is that you offer to them. But they're constantly arguing with you, going back and forth, doing things like that. So that they can continue to feel justified in their, you know, um, cheating or in their lying and things like that. Okay, Princess of Swords and the Five of Wands for our fire signs. We have the Four of Cups and the Six of Cups. I also feel this energy here where they know, um, for some of you, it's because you have children with them that you're not going anywhere, okay? But you feel very much so abandoned, rejected, um, left in the cold by this person. And this is why, because they're still fooling around still doing things on the side okay let us see for our fire signs here all right we have bad health that card's been coming out a lot today for people I feel like this person lying and cheating has been breaking your heart okay as to where it's putting you in a bad health situation we have the coffin here i feel like some of you are going to end up um walking away from this relationship walking away from this person because it's just not worth it okay like i said it's ruining your health it's ruining your livelihood here okay yeah and then we have privileged lady um you take really good care of this person okay yeah it's a a man that i'm talking to or it's a woman who deals with other other women um you take really good care of this person so they're not willing to give that up but i feel like that's the only reason they hold on to you which is literally manipulation okay um but i feel this energy here where you guys are going to be put in a situation financially as to where you can do everything by yourself for yourself you don't need this person and you're just going to walk away from them okay simple as that yeah, and I feel like this is something the universe is gifting you with so that you don't have to stay attached to this person forever. There's definitely a pathway opening here for you guys, okay? So that's your reading.